New at 6, another shoplifting mob storms Michigan Avenue targeting, targeting the Burberry store, and they got away with thousands of dollars worth of merchandise. And WGN's Patrick Elwood is live from the Mag Mile with more on the story. Patrick. Ray, good evening to you. This comes as the police superintendent, David Brown, says they seem to see a pattern emerging, a big picture kind of a thing. That said, people we sp spoke to down here on the Mag Mile shopping say that these crimes should be given the highest priority by police and prosecutors. On the Mag Mile, it's happened again. Thieves hitting a high-end retailer. This time it was the Burberry store in the 600 block of North Michigan Avenue. Police say four men hit the store around 4.15 yesterday afternoon, stealing expensive purses. You're going to play, you should pay, definitely. Katie and Ken are downtown visiting and shopping. They're in from McHenry. They feel that these thefts should be given the highest priority by police and the prosecutors. The thieves should see real jail time, they say. 100%. I mean, we all work hard. I mean, it's not fair. Other people just decide upon themselves to get something for free. You know, that's not, <laughs> it's not right. You know, I mean, we all work hard and we pay and, you know, and they just think they can do whatever they want. The Burberry thefts follow a rash of other thefts in recent days. 14 people hitting the Louis Vuitton store in Oak Brook earlier this month. And then on top of that, detectives are investigating four recent smash and grab retail robberies downtown and on the near northwest side, including the Canada Goose store. Those coats range in price from $500 to $1,500. Just this week, CPD Superintendent David Brown said a bigger pattern seems to be emerging. We've seen across the country uh, burglaries, break-ins, uh, smash and grabs. We have particularly focused on this type of crime here in Chicago, both prevention and enforcement. Police sources tell WGN there has been several U-Haul trucks stolen in recent days, which in the past has coincided with break-ins at high-end city stores as well. Back at the Burberry store, two people suffered minor injuries trying to stop the thieves. And Illinois Attorney General Kwame Raoul is also adding to this conversation, saying that his investigators now believe that these incidents are tied into organized crime networks that often deal in drugs and human trafficking as well. Reporting from the Mag Mile tonight, Patrick Elwood, WGN News. Back to you guys in the studio.